Andy, wow. <laughs> we've done it again. Four nil, big win, top four. No, uh, well, <laughs> may maybe, but let's. Uh, we are right now. So let's enjoy the moment. It's, it's a long way off. I mean, we're 16 points from relegation. We're 40 point target. At the, that's the first hurdle. It's only Steve Bruce, 40 point uh, target. You know, well, it, I mean, it would take a few more games to get that. But now you just. Um, Let's just enjoy the, the wins, the way we're playing. Uh, obviously, it's a shoe in for Manager of the Month there for Eddie. You know, we had some great wins last week. We are built on it. It was important to get a win today. You know, if you win the games like last week and then you drop points. In the first half, the spoiler tactics from Villa, obviously, you know, they're down every few minutes and uh, breaking the play up looked disjointed. It was hard for us to get any rhythm. We started off OK. But then once a goal went in, it was fitting that went in an injury time as well. You know? Up the Premier <laughs> You've just increased the views anyway, because I'm a boring <laughs> bastard with a monotone voice. Yeah, you'll be in the thumbnail then, like. But anyway, um, <laughs> but anyway that's uh, just a great win. And um, but, you know, you've always got to work hard for the first goal in the Premier League. And we did that, you know, we've got physicality with scrap. You get the first goal and then it's uh, it was carnival time in the second half. I mean, it's carnival time. Yeah, changed him as well. It's, it's, it's brilliant, you know. The Brentford game, you know, a goal difference, the highest goal difference I've ever seen for what, like a long time. You know, I mean, it was probably sheer our air days, wasn't it, where we used to have a positive goal difference. And it's a good indicator your goal difference of how you're performing. You know, like in it, a plus 14, it's it's good. And we're stay attacking as well. We could have went to two 0 and we would have won two 0 You know, would have we could have. Lay down to be fair, had a picnic, couldn't we, on our 18 yard box? But we didn't, we wanted more goals. And the uh, substitutions were good, you know, freshens the team up. You have hungry players coming in like Murphy. And the bench, you know, what a contrast from last year. You know, got options on the bench. You take Miggy off, and they're thinking, bloody hell, that workhorse is off. And then you bring Maxi on, and the strength and depth there, man. So I just think it's enjoy it. Uh, let's not get too ahead of ourselves, but. If we can get four points or six points for the next two league games and beat uh, Palace in the Cup, sets were up beautifully before the World Cup. And um, there you may be dead to dream. A few more, a few signings. I think the Saudis might be thinking, you know what, if we'd been sort of eighth or ninth in the league at the moment, they might be thinking, well, well maybe one, two signings. Now they might make the sets, who knows, might be a stellar signing. And if we can accelerate, if we get in the Champions League, great. But I just think, you know, don't put the pressure on the team because. You know, while it was a nil-nil today, it was a tough slog, you know. There's no easy games. We've seen that with the Bournemouth games in the past and the uh, Palace, but we've built on that. We want a good run. Let's just keep it going. Do you think the World Cup race is going to be good or bad for Newcastle? It's a, it's a difficult one, actually. I think it's bad in one sense because we're playing so well and the results are coming, but it might be good that there's more games left for when we make the January signings. Mm. So it's a longer second half of the season with a bigger squad. Those um, guys at the comeback. And... Yeah, exactly. And um, I think if there's any players dipping form, you know, then... You've got Heaton play on the wing as well. He did for um, for Sociedad, you know. So um, we've got we've got options and we've got a bit of depth. And we're, if we're, I do it, I think we'd, we'd be stupid not to, and I think we will. So who knows? But great win, and I'm just enjoying the games. I've learned to smile, you know. It used to be it used yeah. to be a right smile, but now it's you know it's fantastic. So <laughs> hey, good seeing you, Andy. Cheers, Cheers mate. Nice